Do you remember one of the goofiest stables in WWE history called the Spirit Squad? How can you not, as WWE continues to mention the team frequently during their segments? Coming out of WWE's developmental territory, Ohio Valley Wrestling, the five-man team's ring personas were like those of an all-male cheerleading squad. In this video, we'll take a look at where the five members of the Spirit Squad are and what they're doing today. At age 20, Kenny won one half of the World Tag Team titles along with the Spirit Squad. After the faction disbanded, Kenny was sent back to OVW and was later renamed Kenny Dykstra and returned to the main roster but was later released from his contract in November of 2008. He then went on to work with Dragon Gate USA under his real name and later switched to the Evolve promotion. After fighting on different promotions, he took part in Chikaro's 2014 King of Trios tournament using his Spirit Squad character and teaming with Johnny and Mikey. On November 12th, 2016, wrestling in his Spirit Squad attire, Kenny along with Mikey captured the NYWC Tag Team titles from Hounds of Hatred, Boo and Bam Sullivan at Firestorm 3. In April 2017, at Ring of Honor, Kenny and Mikey unsuccessfully challenged the Young Bucks for the World Tag Team titles. Kenny continues to battle on the indie circuit as a solo and a tag team competitor. John Jeter, famously known as Johnny during his time with the Spirit Squad, returned to OVW2 and was renamed Jaden Jeter briefly before being released from his contract somewhere in January of 2008. Following his release, he returned to school at the University of California State and earned a bachelor's degree in accounting. He continued focusing on his personal life and career building while continuing to train regularly. In August 2014, Johnny joined his former teammates Kenny and Mikey to return as the Spirit Squad for the Chikara promotion. However, he didn't stick around too long as once again he left the team after the trio was eliminated from the 2014 tournament. He resides in California working for a management consulting group as an internal auditor. After being released by WWE in May of 2007, Mitch completely disappeared from the pro wrestling scene unlike his other buddies from the Spirit Squad. Instead, Mitch went into other branches of combat sports and began training for a career in MMA under Rocky Long, a former mixed martial artist. On the side in 2007, he and his girlfriend Tori Wilson started a business together, a fashion boutique that they named Officially Jaded. He made his MMA debut under his real name Nick Mitchell on April 9th of 2010, losing to future UFC star Derek Lewis via second round technical knockout. Mitch was set to main event an MMA I pay-per-view show on December 11th of 2010 called Pure Combat 3. Jason David Frank of Power Rangers fame and Mitchell were the two big stars announced for a nightclub show in Houston. Mitchell was then announced as being injured at the last minute, and just 20 minutes prior to the show beginning, it was cancelled. Since then, Mitchell has not taken to the ring again, and he was known to be very injury prone during his WWE tenure. He and Tori Wilson separated in 2011, after which little is known about Mitch and where he is today. Mikey did not venture far away from wrestling and continued to team with Nikki down in OVW as a part of the frat pack before being released from the company in 2008. Mikey and Nikki were living together in Florida during this time and continued to do so for some time to come before he departed for better opportunities. After his WWE release, Mikey returned to competing on the indie circuit and in an interview in December of 2008, he said he planned to wrestle in Mexico and Japan. He would change his ring name to Mike Mondo and competed in numerous promotions such as ROH, Chikara, and the New York Wrestling Connection. NYWC proved to be the most successful promotion for him where he won a number of titles including the NYWC Heavyweight title three times and the NYWC Fusion Championship. He was inducted into their Hall of Fame in 2016. Arguably the most successful member of the Spirit Squad, Nikki would later be repackaged as none other than the show-off Dolph Ziggler. After performing as a part of the frat pack with Mikey and OVW, once the Spirit Squad disappeared from TV on September 15th of 2008, Nikki re-debuted on Raw as a heel, introducing himself in a backstage segment under the name Dolph Ziggler. Soon after, he would be suspended for 30 days due to a violation of WWE's wellness policy. However, this did not stall his progress and he managed to become one of the biggest mid-card acts. Ziggler was able to take part in high-profile feuds and was managed by quite a few different stars, which allowed him to develop his character to a great extent. Ziggler has now held the US title two times, the IC title six times, and even the World Heavyweight title twice. Apart from that, Ziggler has made a name for himself as a stand-up comedian too, as he performs under his real name whenever he takes time off wrestling. As of today, Ziggler has been signed to WWE for nearly 15 years and has no reason or desire to part from the company anytime soon. His name will certainly go down in the history books and he may even be a Hall of Famer after he retires. And these are the Spirit Squad members and where they are now. I hope you're all having an amazing day. Thank you so much for watching Wrestling Hub, and I'll see you later with more videos.